Hello everyone and one welcome back to my channel. My name is Samira. I hope you are all doing well by God's grace. I'm also doing very well. Thank you. So today I don't have a recipe for you, but I have a charcuterie board for you. African Ghanaian charcuterie board. So let's get into it. So what is a charcuterie board? A charcuterie board is a selection of preserved meat and sometimes cheeses laid out on a board or platter. Okay, sliced bread, crackers, biscuits, fruits, and other things are added to it. Today, I'm bringing you my own version, my own African Ghanaian version. Okay, so um, I made sure to bring you all the things that would be available in Ghana. So the fruits that you can literally find in Ghana. Okay. So the word charcuterie is a French word. It means cold cooked meats or cold cuts, right? But today I'm going to, as I mentioned earlier, it's Ghana style, African style. On my board, I have two types of chili, the red and the green chili. I'm here to share this red chili sauce with you, right? And I have some boiled monkey nuts, okay, right? I have some food. So on this board, I have grapes, red and green grapes. I have strawberries. I have oranges. And then I have apples. I'm going to be... I'll put everything on the board. So the arrangement of the board, it's your own style. But then... Um, there is there there are rules. Okay, when it, when we need to follow the charcuterie board rules, they have something called the three 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 rules. Okay, but I'm not going to follow that. I am just doing my own thing, right? Just putting it out there that they have rules the way they put things on the board. But that's not what I am going to do here. I am just borrowing the idea, the concept. Okay, just borrowing it and using my own things, my our own African food african you know delicacies and putting it on there i have some cream crackers i have some chips i have some achomo biscuits digestive shortbread so you can buy some of these things you can make some of these things those that we can make ourselves i have recipes of all of them that i'll be bringing to you as the weeks go by right i have plantain chips okay the plantain chips i have the green plantain chips i have the ripe plantain chips then i also have spicy ripe plantain chips i also have some lavash kidi okay well this is something that is coming to me from my childhood memory right and um lavash kidi is the laughing cow that's what we used to call it back then i don't know right i have that as well so that one to pair that with your cream crackers okay and if you have some bread some tea bread you can slice those ones as well i also have some meat okay so charcuterie board will not be complete without meat so i have some chofi oh, well it's not really chofi but sliced turkey wings and turkey drumsticks then i have some pork okay fried pork as well domido right i also have fried plantain fried ripe plantain just a cocoa chip okay so all these things are then i have bow fruit the bow fruit i fried i cut them into stars and love shapes and i fried them just to make the board nice and the chips too i did something else to it the achomo i have four different kinds of achomo i have nuts i have ground nuts okay and as i said the arrangement it's your own style but you have to think about the practicality of your guests picking these um, items or snacks okay let's say for instance the grapes and um, i put them at the corners of the board that is because sometimes there's a bit of resistance in pulling the grapes so if it's in the middle as they pull it it can knock something off you know and scatter things so you have to think about all that and maybe not letting the meat touch the, the fruits or if you are adding boiled eggs okay make sure you you divide them into two so that's easier for them to scoop the pepper and put put it on it rather than them doing it themselves trying to cut the eggs and you know what i mean you know think about you know very simple common sense practical things that you know can go wrong or can make these things not taste very nice okay you do you literally wow your guests when you make this for them you can make it on a small platter or on a big board okay whatever you have something small you bring a few things together you can be creative and get your own items to put on it it can be spring rolls both anything 
that you want that is you can nibble on your, your guests can nibble on them i also have cake ghana pound cake as well so all these things are all possibilities just be creative and create something beautiful for your guests this is a really nice thing that i made it for my guests and they really loved it they really really loved it and you just wow them and they'll be happy and they eat it and they'll eat and eat and eat and eat it's like so many things to choose from which one should i go for new i'm in for new i'm in for that kind of thing right so yeah thank you for joining me today i'll be bringing you some of the recipes on this board the ones i made myself on this board so look out for it and if you like this video and many more that i have to offer in that on my channel please consider subscribing like this video and Thank you all and I will see you in the very next one. Bye.